Hello everybody, thank you for joining us today. We are celebrating the month of August and exploring the colour palette of Sun Orange. So today we're going to be focusing on a simple vase arrangement and we're going to be creating a, a foam-free, opulent, loose urn arrangement. So I have an absolutely glorious selection of flowers to use today, starting off with Antorinum, we might know them as snapdragons, Leucospermum, this variety is called Tango, then I have some really a funky amaranthus. This one's called Amaranthus Hot Biscuit. Isn't that fabulous? Then I have some Estilbe Paul Garda. And it's a fabulous rich burgundy tone to that one. And we have Chrysanthemum Bloom. This one's called Barker Red. Again, a beautiful rich claret almost colour tone to that. And then the focus of our colour scheme this month, which is the orange, we have a spray rose called Babe. It does actually have a slight hint to burgundy on the edge of it, so it blends in beautifully. Then we've got this rather, whoops, <laughs> rather lovely Asclepia, which helps to add some texture to the design. Then we have this, again, this, this rose, although orange, does actually have beautiful hints of red to the outer guard petals. And this rose is called Morning Sun. So, so appropriate for sun orange. And then last but by no means least, we have some preserved eucalyptus. This is from the Autumn Mix. So you can see within that we've got sort of brown tones, red tones, burgundy tones. And if you turn it over, you've got some orangey hints as well. Okay, so that's our flower content. Then the sundries that I'm using, I've got some mesh, copper mesh, my trusty scissors, and of course my container, which is this beautiful urn. This is an eco-friendly design, so it brings out the opulent and luxurious feel to the arrangement by using this fantastic colour palette. The gold tones within the orange signify material and spiritual well-being and wealth. So it makes it a really appropriate arrangement to pop into a grand entrance of a stately home or a hotel. It really creates an impression. You'll, you'll notice as we progress on that the darker burgundy tones actually help to offset the orange tones, so it gives warmth and character to the composition. It's kind of an unexpected colour pairing really. I think you'll agree it works really well. So enjoy!
So I hope that's given you some inspiration to have a go at making this yourself. As always, I've got some top tips for you. So top tip number one, when you pop the mesh or the chicken wire, or whatever you use, into the vase, don't crush it too tightly, because you actually need the larger stems to go through the wire, actually into the water. All right, top tip number two, make sure all the flowers are conditioned well before you use them. And then top tip number three, if you were to use a vintage gold um, container rather than the grey urn that I've used, it would give, give added opulence to the design and reinforce those warm colour tones. Anyway, thank you so much for watching today. Um, next month, we'll be celebrating September already. <laughs> and we'll be welcoming in the new colour astrology for September, which is Bayer Blue. So really excited about that one, so don't miss that. All right, don't forget to share, like us, and obviously visit our YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe there as well for lots of more tips, hints, and inspirational ideas that you can create for yourself. All right, until we see you next time, thank you once again, and it's bye for now.